Hey everyone, Admiral Seabass here. I'm going to do an unboxing video here. Um, if you've watched me play Vietnam Solitaire Special Edition, um, you know that that is a game from White Dog Games, and uh, they make a lot of solitaire games. Um, and uh, this one really interested me, uh, Mrs. Thatcher's War, uh, the, night, the Falcons War, um, 1982. And uh, you can see here, it says that this is banned in Argentina. I don't know if that's real or not, but uh, it is kind of funny. Um, and you can see on the back here um, what this is. Uh, it talks a little bit about the game. Um, one player, uh, sorry about the glare there, uh, one to two hours, one to three hours, ages 13 plus. Uh, solitaire, it is a solitaire game and with uh, low, low to medium complexity. So let's see what we get in the box here. So the box up and this is a I think a laser die cut game so you can kind of smell that that the <laughs> the burning uh from from the, the lasers so here you see um first thing you got is a, a player aid card um and uh looks like these are kind of some um mostly this side focused on random events um on the back here you have a detailed sequence of play uh, and some air battle results table down here. So we'll have to see what that, that is all about. Um, and then here you've got some charts and tables for Mrs. Thatcher's War. Uh, task Force Engagement Table. That's kind of cool. I wonder if you can go after the uh, Argentine carriers. Um, and uh, airstrike table, ground combat modifications, discard pile, and units not in the box. That's interesting. Nothing on the back of that. And then here is... This is a strategic map. And uh, this looks like mainly in Argentina here. There's some different sectors here, perhaps, that the Argentines attack through. The Falcon Islands themselves down here, Trala and South Georgia. Ground support tracks, weather, uh, an Ascension Island. Uh, I wonder if that's where the um, Vulcan bombers took off from. Um, really good documentaries on that, by the way, on the Vulcan bomber raid. Uh, if you want to check that out, I'm not sure exactly where it is. Nothing on the back there. And here are the laser cut die or the laser die cut counters here for uh, Mrs. Thatcher's War. You can see uh, again. Sorry about. Let's see if I can get it better here uh, just the shadow is no good so um, the Argentine units in blue the uh, British units in red um, and uh, all kinds of fun stuff there um, and then uh, some some uh, indices on the back but not very many and then here you got the map um, we'll look at the map in a minute this is the the rule book um, about this is a little longer than the Vietnam uh, rule book uh, that I'm playing, so it looks like this one's got a little more complexity than that game. Got some uh, g some blue and, and red um, highlighting there. Not sure what that that is, but uh, oh, and then there's some nice pictures on the back of the Falklands. I'm assuming. And then let's take a look at the map here and see what the map looks like. So this is the island itself. And um, you've got the turn track down here. Of course, Margaret Thatcher there. Different air sectors, landing zones. Um, yeah, I, I'm not as familiar historically with the Falklands, so... Um, I, I not this isn't all like ringing a huge bell with me here in terms of historically, but part of the reason I bought this game is to learn more about it. Uh, you see, you got naval gunfire support here, got an airstrip down here, airstrip up here. It'll be interesting to see how that all uh, plays out. And uh, nothing on the back of the map. So that is uh, unboxing of Mrs. Thatcher's War. I uh, hope you enjoyed this, and uh, if you want to check it out, uh, White Dog Games makes it. Take care, everyone. Admiral Seabass signing off.